In our today's video we want to talk about the top 7 most expensive big motorbikes in the world. Don't forget to watch to the very last second of the video. What are the 710 most expensive big bikes at the start of 2023? As fast as the world is diving headlong to a massive sea of upheavals, a lot has also changed since we last featured the top 7 most expensive big motorbikes in the world. For one thing, the new lowest entry at number 7 clocks at almost 130 grand more than its predecessor, while the $1 million tag price of the previous number 1, the highly regarded Cosmic Starship by Harley Davidson seems paltry, now compared to the latest title holder, Neiman Marcus Limited Edition Fighter, which clips the bar at an awesome $11 million mark. Most Expensive Big Motorbikes in the World 1. Neiman Marcus Limited Edition Fighter $11 million Steampunk triumphs with the Neiman Marcus Limited Edition Fighter. There, that's out first thing. Whoever saw it coming that Neiman Marcus Limited Edition Fighter would later claim pole position at any top 10 list of big bikes is probably a seer of the highest order, especially when one considers how it began the market at a humble $110,000. And mind you, Neiman Marcus is a name you would rightly connect with department store rather than a superbike. The unique clockwork design, however, seems to have taken care of all that. The bike's eye-catching chassis, carved from a single piece of metal, proved to be an extreme hit with enthusiasts. 2. 1949 E90 AJS Porcupine $7 million A bike manufacturer with a rich history and winning racetrack heritage marred by several financial turbulence early on, AJS could only manage to produce four Porcupine units in 1949. As it turned out, one of these under the very able hands of Les Graham won the 1949 World Championship. An open frame, aluminium alloy, 500cc, DOHC twin engine with horizontal cylinders and heads give the Porcupine a low center of gravity. It uses what's called, jam pot, shocks and telehydraulic race forks. The design and manufacturing decisions made by AJS first through the original owners and then through the succeeding ones read like a virtual and veritable source of what to do ideas for any aspiring bike professional. Having lived through the Cold War itself, the veteran Porcupine then spent 20 years in the Coventry National Motorcycle Museum before being made available for the refined enthusiast with a deep pocket to match. 3. Akasi ES1 Spirit $3.6 million when a bike manufacturer requires even a professional driver to first take a two-week training before trying to ride one of its models, you just know something is up with this bike. Swing arm and rear suspension attached to the gearbox, and front suspension to the engine. The much-touted 265-pound spec of a weight comes from eliminating the extra pounds associated with transmitting front wheel forces up a slender fork through a steering head then back down to the rest of the machine. The front suspension consists of twin arms, projecting forward, their apices defining a steer axis and carrying an upright from which projects the front wheel spindle. The lower arm is, in effect, a single-sided swing arm. 4. Hildebrand & Wolfmuller $3.5 million History is expensive, and at $3.5 million your purchase would send you back 124 years ago to 1894 when this first production motorcycle appeared on the scene. Heinrich and Wilhelm Heidbrand were steam engine engineers before they teamed up with Alois Wolfmüller to produce their internal combustion motorrad in Munich in 1894. This momentous event started sending the flesh and blood steeds out of fashion, reinventing themselves as emblem of the refined gentry, while the special breed of men simply moved on and transferred their affections to the two-wheeled metallic petrol-guzzling steeds that took over the roads. 5. BMS Nemesis $3 million the first thing you would notice about the BMS Nemesis is the yellow glitter and absence of side stand, making it look like it's lying flat on its underbelly like a marooned whale. In fact it would, fully functional, it incorporates an air ride system that, along with the single-sided swingarm rear suspension, can lift the motorcycle 10 inches or lower it right onto the ground. This renders a side stand unnecessary, as Nemesis softly lands on its frame rails when it's time to park. 6. Harley-Davidson Cosmic Starship $1.5 million What used to occupy first place in many top 10 list of most expensive big bikes is now only good for a sixth position. If that happens, it should recapture the crown it once had, or not, since we don't imagine the rest of the entries here would remain with static prices days ahead too. Not a few people already consider most big bikes as a work of art in their own right, so making one that is a literal work of art is the next obvious step. Right? Harley Davidson appears to think so, and in their Cosmic Starship, they partnered with the famed rebel cosmic existentialist artist Jack Armstrong to apply yellow and red paint over a Harley V-Rod and originally sold it at a flat $1 million after much fanfare broadcast all over the world. 7. 
Dodge Tomahawk V10 Superbike $550,000 If you think the Dodge Tomahawk V10 Superbike suspiciously looks like a four-wheel Dodge squeezed on both sides, you won't be alone. This Tomahawk V10 Superbike is a strange beast indeed, and not just because it uses a V10 four-stroke Dodge Viper engine that could easily power up any chassis with more than two wheels attached to it to give you the feeling of being dragged by a fleet of 500 supercharged ponies looking forward to storm the Bastille. Now talk about the soul of two-wheel steeds. As introduced in 2003, the one-of-a-kind Tomahawk was operational and road-ready, but not fully road-tested. At the minimum, this Tomahawk is capable of reaching 60 miles per hour, 96.5 kilometers per hour, in about 2.5 seconds with a theoretical top speed of 400 miles per hour. Evil Knievel probably, but he's long retired at the time of the Tomahawk's release and now he's dead. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. To keep you updated don't forget to turn on the notification bell.